What's good, YouTube? I'm going to you back again once again. Today, people, today we are back for episode number 11 of our Captain Toad Treasure Tracker Cooperative Let's Play with the pinnacle of Mario LPs on YouTube, Mr. PK Sparks, the hotness. Yeah! Okay, that wasn't the best, y'all, but yo, I love this game so much. Oh my god, you guys missed it. Floaty fun, fun, fun water park, and then you had the stupid pack. Anybody care about that? Then you had Sinister Street Sign with the Mud Troopers, and then you had the Minecraft. Sunset Rundown where Nappy was freaking out and it was amazing. And then we have more chapters and more chapters and more chapters. And then we have another episode and then we got so many more stages. And <laughs> I this think is, what oh PK God. is saying, if you missed out on the last episode, which is over on his channel, definitely make sure you go check it out. Link to his channel is included in the description with his Twitter as well. Uh, if you guys don't know by now, we're 11 episodes in. The episodes bounce back and forth between our channels. So if you're not subscribed to both Nappy the Great and The Hotness, make sure you are so you don't miss out on an episode period and of course if you guys are proud members of the nappy nation and if you're a proud citizen of a pk planet make sure you smash the like button down below for us because you already know your support is greatly appreciated you guys support interaction just builds and makes the series what it is so we want to thank you guys so much for that and of course you guys already know we're 11 episodes in you heard me say it once you hear us say it every single episode if this episode can smash we can destroy 1000 likes in the next episode episode number one two 12 will be uploaded over on PK's channel as soon as humanly possible. So, I mean, it's up to y'all. It's up to y'all. And Bum. you never know, like I, like we said before, if the history, the true history of the Mushroom Kingdom doesn't get explained in this video, it just may happen in the next episode. I'm just, I'm just saying. There it is. I'm just saying. There it is. But besides that, I think I'm ready to, to move on. I think I'm ready. I, I know I'm ready to move on. Alright, give us a countdown, PK, for the next page. Three, two, one, kick it! Boom, boom, boom. Oh <laughs> no! Hammer Bros. <sighs> this is gonna be just like the minecart. Like anytime they ever put you in an area where you can't control yourself, <sighs> drift along <laughs> canyon, drift along canyon. We have I, will, I will bros. say, I like the purple water. <laughs> yeah, that thing can kill you. Don't don't touch the purple drink. <laughs> I mean, I mean, don't touch the purple drink, Nappy. I mean, I mean, I mean Gengar <laughs> don't, is don't be, don't be taking him by the lure of the purple. <laughs> Gengar, Gengar is a poison type. He, I'm sure you can handle it. I'm sure you can True. handle it. True, true. But anyways, are we ready to? Are we ready to jump in? I am ready. So, no, we're not jumping in. It's poison. Poison is purple drink. I mean, are you ready to, to dip your toes into the water and feel how? Cool Again, it is? poison is purple drink. <laughs> what are you messing here? All right, here we go. Three, two, one. Go! Hey! Player 2, press start. Drift along canyon. Here I go! Alright, so what are we doing okay, here? So I'm, I'm gonna look around place. here before we go down. We got coins. So what do you think the challenge is gonna be? Uh, just, oh my goodness, destroy the hammer, bros. And I meant, I failed the challenge already. Okay, oh, never so mind, they gets... grow back, they grow back. The turnips on the on the raft grow back, never calm mind. Calm down, calm down. Oh, wait, oh, coins! Oh, oh, coins! Oh, oh. I, saw, I saw them too, I saw them too, I missed them. Oh, I missed them. Well, looks like we can be playing this level. Stop throwing hammers! Who does that? Hammer bros. This is like stupid. It's like fire bros throw fire. Why of all things would you choose to throw hammers? Oh, hey, we can go on this thing. Ooh, hello, Mr. Diamond? Alright, what's here? I got my first diamond already. Oh, there it is. Oh, that's sweet. <laughs> Wait, can you go back on the raft? Will it go, will it go back? Probably not. It doesn't go back. Okay, it doesn't. I repeat, it does not go back. Ladies and gentlemen, we have confirmation. It does not go back. It's just a very sad day. Hey, nice and mushroom. Right, so oh, what's this thing do? There. Nice and ladder. What's this thing do? How am I supposed to break the power block? Oh, never mind. I, I Can be, we just I touch be, it? I be you can't touch it. I be speaking. Ooh. Ooh. So what's this thing? I don't know if we should take this first, though. Oh, Let's I feel it. like you can drop down no matter what if I go up here. What's the red, the red hammer? It rises up. Not red hammer, um... Give me a diamond, give me, yeah, give me a diamond. Come here, come here, come here! A... Gotcha. Another diamond? A Pickaxe! A get over there, get over there, get over there! Oh, there, there it is, I got the same thing. Go, 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 go! Okay, we're good, we're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. Oh, wait, oh, these are all like golden, oh, I wish I knew that. Oh, I would've just kept going. Hey, I got so many. 
I got so many. I got a one up. I'll take I got so up. many. All right, it's these like, red bullet bills are dangerous because they were homing on you. So um, that's what that's careful. what I was asking. I was like, what do the red ones do? Yeah, yeah, yeah they they, they, they homing on you. They are destructive. Hey, man, ain't nobody care about no red bullet bills. Oh well, got hit, got body. Ain't nobody care about no red bullet bills. Red bullet bill, red red bullet bills. It can catch a turn and bust a red bullet bill. Red bullet bill. Dang it, I missed the diamond. Stop it, red bullet bill. I got hit and I missed the diamond. Give me the diamond! Woo! Did you get did you get the diamond? Yes, I got all three diamonds. Yeah, and I didn't get hit by a red bullet bill. Let's go! Well, you did better than me. I missed the diamond and I got hit by a bullet bill. Come on, bullet bill. Yeah, that's what I thought. You better stay there. You better stay there if you know what's good for you. Mess with oh, Captain and there's, a, there's a Luigi in the back. In the back. I'm gonna go I'm gonna go oh never mind. I was gonna go back there. I got oh, all, yeah! my, all my stuff. I mean, I still don't know what the challenge could be though. Didn't take any damage. Are you serious? <laughs> That's the challenge? <laughs> That's the challenge. Wow. So you did it. Yeah. That's imperfect. So I got a long way to go. I got I gotta restart the entire stage just to get that diamond. Whoa! Wait, no, 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 no! Oh well, I was gonna say never mind. There's 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 coins hidden right there at the start tree, and then I forgot the whole stack right there. But I'm not I'm not too worried about it. I'm not too worried about it. what's this for? Oh, oh hello, there's a gold mushroom. Yeah. Wait, where'd ah. you go? Hmm? Where'd you go? When you pull the when you pull the thing up, you have to go back down before you get the power star. Oh, I didn't even think about that. I just, hey, I just... power star, three gold diamonds. I said gold diamonds. Power star, got three diamonds, and I beat that challenge. Hey, I was yeah, I, I, I gotta go back on the raft and try to get that third diamond. I just I just I just finished the first raft, so I got a little while to go. Yeah. Well, I think now is a good time as any to go ahead and uh, break down the next chapter of of the of the true history, the true history of the Koopa Kingdom. Very true. So, you guys, where, where did we leave off? Where, where did we leave off last? Um, I believe we were going to learn about the about Rosalina, like her history behind the the um behind the Mushroom Kingdom and Peach and whatnot. Uh, okay, if, if we're at the right spot, if we're at the right spot, if we're at the right spot, which I think we are, I, I'm pretty sure I know what comes next. Um, so anyway, so anyway, so anyway, so you guys know about how Bowser, he's been usurped from his throne, and, and Super Mario Galaxy, that's what we were talking about last time, was Super Mario Galaxy was the closest attempt that King Bowser had ever had. Closest, the closest time that he's ever come to throwing his oppressors off and reclaiming his rightful throne. And of course, we didn't get to see it from his perspective. It'd be nice if we could have seen Super Mario Galaxy and Super Mario Galaxy 2 through Bowser's eyes and his perspective, but we, of course, were never given the chance because that's just how Nintendo is. So either way, either way, either way, either way, either way. Moving along, uh, has anybody ever paused to think, where did Rosalina come from? Um, I have. I just didn't question it too much. Where, where did this, this, this new, brand new uh, uh, character? This, this, uh, this, this, would you say, would you say Rosalina is, like, uh, parallel to a princess? Um, yeah. Where did this, where did this person just magically appear from? This person that just happens to run the Comet Observatory and all of this. So, let's, let's back up a little bit further, let's back up a little bit further. So, so tell me, PK, Mr. Pinnacle, regale us okay. with the, the purpose, or the origins, if you will, of the Comet Observatory. The Common Observ Observatory is essentially made as a home for Rosalina to protect the Lumas. The Lumas that were around that she met in Earth, uh, that she met in space. Uh, do you want me to go back to where how Rosalina got into space or that's not necessary? Go ahead, go ahead. Alright, so Rosalina was born into space because she was looking for her mama. She lost her mama. It, it, was, it was a sad story for her. So she ended up meeting a Luma and they went to go look for her mama and they ended up going into space. Through that, um, she ended up meeting more Lumas, and she realized that the Lumas were her family, or you know, her new family at least. So she started taking care of them to make sure they become the go um, stars and whatnot, because they told her that they could, she couldn't, def they couldn't defend themselves on their own themselves, their own. So that's the purpose of the Comet Observatory to make sure that she can just make sure that all the Lumas are safe and protect them. So I don't know about you guys. But the biggest flaw in that entire story, which doesn't make any sort of sense, is I, I mean I mean I mean I don't know about you, but if I was on this this quest to find my mom, I wouldn't just stop and give up and just say, oh well, I'm just gonna sorry mom. <laughs> sorry, I'm done looking for <laughs> just you. Just sorry, mom. No, it doesn't make any sense at all. 
Rosalina is again a princess. I mean, I know I said earlier a parallel to a princess, but that was because I didn't want to drop the bombshell on you. Rosalina is in fact a princess, and just like Daisy's distress signal, that's not exactly what happened. She wasn't quote unquote looking for her mother and she just decided to stop. No, she was abducted from her rightful place, her, her original home, and put in charge of the Comet Observatory. Does anybody know where Rosalina comes from? Mm, just that she was on Earth. PK, PK. I Rosalina, only know the Rosalina lore is in that I've been she told. is in fact she is in fact in charge of uh, 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 the Common Observatory and Rosalina's story is one that we have not been introduced to yet. We haven't seen one, we haven't we don't have one that's parallel to it. But the biggest bombshell of them all, I told you guys in the last episode, you're gonna drop your jaws and hit the ground when you hear this, is that the Common Observatory is not only it has not only interfered with the Koopa Kingdom. The Common Observatory is a multi-dimensional and when I say multi-dimensional multi multiple universes the common observer can reach into and mess with does anybody else know do, do you do you know of any other princesses in in Nintendo lore um you have Peach you have Daisy you have Rosalina no 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 no, no. I said Nintendo lore like in general yes hmm that's a good question does the name Zelda, Zelda yeah. ring a bell? Zelda. Zelda is basically a parallel to Princess Peach in the Kingdom of Hyrule. Zelda works for the Common Observatory. You think the entire world is just messed up and this one kid, Link, this one kid, Link, is supposed to be the one saving it? Come on, uh, to be fair, in Ocarina of Time, he is made to be 17 years old, so that way he has the power and strength to become a true hero in time. Come on now. Come on now. You can't you can't spin that story to me. And I know that I know Zelda fans watching are gonna be upset. I know they're gonna be upset because you don't wanna hear this. You don't wanna hear this. But Zelda, parallel to Mario, works for not not Zelda, um Link, not yeah, Link parallel to Mario, Zelda parallel to Peach. All of it is parallel, and in turn, again. Ganondorf, he's the big bad guy, right? He's the one that's he's supposed to. He's the one that's messing everything up, right? And he would parallel to Bowser. Exactly. Not in the exact same. I'm not saying they have the same struggle, the same fight. It's just Ganondorf recognizes and realizes the threat, and realizes the hierarchy, and wants to overthrow it, so the Kingdom of Hyrule can come back to happy times. Now I'm not going to sit here and try and regale you with the true history of Hyrule or anything like that. I'm just I'm just letting you know. That the Common Observatory, you know, the the, the the Koopa Kingdom is the only one that it has its hands involved with. So, the Common Observatory, the Common Observatory doesn't just rule over the Mushroom Kingdom. The Koopa it, Kingdom. It didn't just manipulate Princess Peach or Mario, but it also manipulates other dimensions, universes. Let's not, let's not, let's not use the word manipulate, because that implies that Princess Peach is somehow innocent in all of this. Is the, is the place behind the madness in mm -hmm. the Mushroom Kingdom. Mm -hmm. Wow. And the Kingdom of Hyrule. And I'm sure there's other dimensions and universes out there that, that the, common, the, the, the Common Observatory has their hands involved with. And all I'm saying is, I, I'm, I'm just going gonna, gonna to leave it right here at this for, this for this installment, this chapter. All I'm saying is the next chapter will be another chapter that, that your jaw will hit the ground because there are many theories, there's a lot of speculation out there as to who in fact is behind the Common Observatory because Rosalina just runs it. That's all she's there for. She's like a general in the army. She commands uh, Zelda, she commands Peach, she, she does all that stuff. I, I'm just letting y'all know, you can choose to believe if you want. I, you can you can choose to be a believer if you want. If you if you if you're okay with believing the, the Nintendo propaganda and how how they present it to you, then by all means, by all means, keep living your life the way you are. But if you want to be enlightened and you want to understand what's truly going on, taking the blue pill. If you if you just if you want to know what's actually happening, just just take a listen. Put the wow. put the Kool Aid down. That's all I gotta say. Wow.
I, 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 that's all I can say. So did you beat your challenge, PK? Yes, I have beaten the challenge. I have got all the diamonds. I am ready to move on. All right, give us a countdown, PK. I, I mean, how can I count after that? I'm going to try to. Um, 37, 79, <laughs> 4, <laughs> go! All right. <laughs> Sliding, slap, shuffle. <laughs> so the challenge in this is going to be like beat it in under five moves or whatever. Oh, I didn't even see the outline. Oh, okay. Let's look at yeah. the big old gingerbread house. I'm hungry. <laughs> I'm hungry. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's what some David would say. I'm hungry. I feel like he does say that. I feel like he in the case, in the case, in the case. Let's get, let's get it started. Three, two, one, go. Oh, by the way, we started this with um this video with 69 diamonds. Low. Yeah. I'm just saying. Giggity, 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 goo. And look, the moment I say goo, all the all the coins hello. Are. Oh, look at look all these coins. Hello, coins. Mm -hmm. I'm grabbing you because you may be a challenge. I mean, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna worry about the challenge. If if the challenge is in fact to to do this in a certain number of moves, I'm not gonna worry about it this second. Oh, I'm gonna worry about it. Well, I mean, you would have to do, you have to hit that one twice in order to get up there. Wait, so I mean, what, I what, what? Oh, snap! I wow, I set myself up. What? What happened? PK Sparks the hotness. I got bodied by bullet bills. You can't walk between them? Ugh. That seems kind of booty. This is dangerous. Uh, get up there, get up there, Toadette. I mean... What exactly are you supposed to... How? Get that mushroom. Push that one back. Push that back. Push Wait, that back. Okay, okay, okay. So then you, then you tap it and it goes. But how do you get that diamond? Oh, wait, what? I see. I see. I see. You tricking me. I see the big dog. I don't see. Hold on. Hold I'm about on, to get this on. diamond. I'm about to get this diamond, though. Hold on, wait. Hold the phone. Hold the phone. I'm slow sometimes, okay? Ha, I get body. Get body, so, uh, 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 get body. There's a door in there. And then we flip, touch that again. Flip it. Oh, I see, I see, I see, I see, I see, I see. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold the fun. Hold the fun, sir. Please hold the fun. Okay, so wait, that's just, that's only the second diamond. Where's the, th or maybe that's the third one. I found maybe all three. Maybe I missed it. Ah, missed you! What are you, soldier boy? <laughs> yes, essentially. Captain towed up in his hole. So I'm gonna get that. That's the second one. Okay, so so I'm I'm still on track. I'm still on track. I'm still on track. Clear the course in four touches. Yeah, I'm I'm messed that one up. Yeah, you're way past that. Uh, wait, 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 wait a second. Wait a second. Wait a second. My thing is, I'm still looking for the. Th I'm, I'm guessing it's in the plant. It's gotta be in the plant. My thing is, I just want to make this the easiest way I can to get back up here. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we here we go. Slide me across. Okay. And then if we do this, please don't hit me. Thank you. Hey. Oh, I messed. Wait, no, 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 I didn't mess up. I didn't mess up yet. I didn't mess up yet. Oh wait, wait for it. Wait for it. Are you nope, kidding me? Up. Oh I my goodness. Up. Go toe that, go toe that, go. Go toe that, go toe that, go. There we go. Okay. That, that bullet bullet shouldn't have hit me. That shouldn't have hit me. How am I going to get this? Here I go. Okay, so yeah. So clear the course and four You gotta touches. tap it once right there. You gotta tap it twice, actually. What, the first one? Yeah, we gotta tap that twice to get up and up, up and over. Mm hmm. So, I mean, if that, that one's. Uh, I feel like it's just the, it's just the the two that you see at the beginning right here. It'll be the only two that you have to actually touch. Wait, 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 wait. I think I get it. I think I get it. I think, no, 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 that's not going to do it. One, two. Wait, how do you? Cause I need to get on top of there. Uh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. One, two. 
You gotta move that one over, so that's three right there. Even though I haven't touched it yet, that's three. Yeah, see if I took... And that's five times, so I lost. So how am I supposed to do this? Okay, so there's one, again. there's one that you're touching that we have to avoid. Well, I'm just looking at it, and I, I don't see any way. We gotta wait, wait, wait. Oh, you don't have to touch the first one. That's you can go up a little. I was, I was literally just thinking that. Wow. Okay. All right. That saves a lot of time. That saves a lot of issues. And that's two. Then I hit it again. That's three. Why don't know why I be like that though? Told that, told that you better run. You better run your stubby little legs out. Stop playing, girl. I there you go. Start running because I clicked it to figure that out. Hold the fun, man. All right, I got it. Here I go. So you don't have to push. Yeah, like that. That's what yeah, I'm saying. You can just walk. Right. Yeah, there you go. You don't have to touch that one at all. So you just go around. Blah blah blah. Excuse me, thought that. Excuse me, thought that. So you now you touch the bottom one. Yeah, and you have to push the top one back, and then push it back out, and that makes three. And, and then you, you push back, back in. in. Yep, yep, exactly. Excuse me. So that's two. Excuse me. Excuse me. Give me the diamonds. I'm gonna put some blistex on my lips in the meantime. Okay, I don't so know wait, about y'all, but um, I don't live in Arizona, and it's cold over here. You still have to use chapstick in Arizona because it's dry. PK. Can I just? Can I just? Can I just hate on Arizona? No, cause Arizona's amazing. I mean, if it's iced tea, then yeah. <laughs> I, hope, I hope you fall. I hope you fall. Now, I mean, I'm just saying, I I don't have to wear a winter jacket, and there's not snow on the ground right now. <laughs> just count down the next stage. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, I think we're gonna save the next stage for the next episode. Oh, over on Mr. That Hotness's channel. Ow. So either way, if you guys enjoyed today's episode of Captain Toad, make sure you smash that like button down below for it. And like we just said, the next episode will be over on PK's channel. So if you're not subscribed, definitely make sure you check out the link to his channel and his Twitter in the description so you can stay updated on everything that is going down. But with that, we're going to go ahead and get up out. Like we said at the beginning of the video, if we can smash 1,000 likes, if you're a proud member of the Nappy Nation, the citizen of the PK planet, make sure you smash the like button down below for us, and if we can destroy a thousand, next episode will go up as soon as we can get it up over on PK's channel, but with that, we're gonna moonwalk out of here. Moonwalk? <laughs> He's like, wait a minute. <laughs> I didn't know I was a this go off. <laughs> Anyways, thank you guys so much for your support, and thank you for checking out the video. You don't mean you do that when I ain't too. Yeah!